Welcome back everyone to Old War Blues to, as you can see, the Enclave. Yes, I have decided to make a full bomb playthrough with the Enclave. Now bear in mind, this one, actually hold on, is it too loud? No. Bear in mind that this one uh, will be played on just a normal difficulty, so it might be relatively easy, but I just wanted to play with the Enclave. Now, the situation is, if you remember my uh, video tutorial on how to play the Enclave, essentially uh, I have most of the focus tree done as, uh, in the political parts and all of this, but you do get the normal new arena focus tree, so I do still have the expansion parts, I do still have some of the economic parts um, to complete. It's 2277, and let's get this started. Uh, I'm gonna take expansionism to try to get as much uh, done as possible as quickly as possible, so that hopefully it's not too boring. Now, uh, my starting situation, if you may call it that, is that, um, well, I have, tw th these are the only infantry units that I've built, 24 infantry. They are just infantry plus machine gun support, so nothing too major. And I, of course, have the five enclave uh, armor power armor units uh, that you get right off the bat. And actually, hmm, I might want to... I'm going to do something a little bit different than what I usually do. I'm going to promote this guy to a field marshal. And I'm going to give him all of my regular infantry units. And on the side, I'm going to have Sergeant Granite with the uh, power armor troops. So the first target is likely going to be... Uh, no, hold on. The first target is going to be uh, the... Antelope tribe up here to the north. Uh, my economy right now is 25 factories, so I'm not that strong. And right now, of course, the other players in the wasteland are expanding and doing their own thing. So it's not going to be as easy in some ways because well, people are getting stronger, very, very much stronger. As you can see, the NCR as well expanding up. And they're even making a war on some of these bandits down here. So it should hopefully be interesting, especially because the NCR are my uh, neighbors, my close neighbors. Actually, I do have close air supports and transports. Huh. So that means that I have paratroopers because these power armor troops can paradrop. Hmm. Well, it's relatively risky to use this, actually, to be honest. Because, I mean... I'm I don't want to lose the paratroopers already, or rather, not the paratroopers, but the power armor, because this power armor equipment is relatively hard to replace, even with our national spirits that do grant us some additional uh, additional production for this. Where is it? Right, over here. Do grant us additional production for that, but yeah, don't want to lose that. It's expensive and all of that. So I'm going to keep them in reserve for now, uh, because I don't need them to crush these poor little uh, infantry, I don't think. Yeah, look at that. They're weak. They're weak and we can kill them. Alright, binoculars. Uh, and yeah, let's try to get as much tech as possible, of course. Uh, we probably can, yeah, we probably should go with maintenance companies. And we can actually uh, get laser muskets and Tesla energy weapons. I don't know if these count as infantry equipment, do they? Well, they must in some way. But I guess first we must actual, actually produce like things that we need right now before we start producing advanced stuff. No point. And I'm actually going to use these guys and... Uh, Put them in a new theater and give them a higher priority, just to be sure. All right, so we're about to get that war goal, and these first wars should be relatively easy. It's later that things are going to get interesting. And yeah, getting more infantry. Send them to the front line and all of that. Actually, don't have any manpower. Ooh. So it's going to be good to capture this guy, so that we get more manpower. 
Great Khans. Huh, didn't even know that the Great Khans were around, but it looks like they're gonna get killed by New Vegas, so they're not gonna be around for long. All right. Mm, I don't think we can, I don't think it's a good idea to get the core right away. The other person that we're gonna get war goes on is the Yakuza territory, so let's do that. I don't think it's gonna take two months to defeat the Antelope Reservation. I think it's gonna be relatively easy. All right, um, might as well use the close air support, even though mm, it might lose us some gunships, which I hope it does not. All right. Yeah, at this point, for these guys, it's just a matter of killing them. All right. Yeah, our men are, of course, stronger just because, you know, there's a lot of them. Basic forges, primitive workshops, yay. All right, activate the plans and just go. Easy peasy, they are surrounded and they are dead. All right, once we take this little town, we're gonna be sudden mash. Easy peasy. As expected. So there we are. It's them gone. And now let's turn our attention to the Japanese. Or, I don't know. I don't know what they're supposed to be. Apparently, it's all canon, but yeah. Okay, antelope preservation. I guess we should repair these factories first, just to be sure. And yeah, what is this equipment classified as? Is it infantry equipment? Is it what? I don't know. I think it's infantry equipment. Pack guns, explosive, anti tank. Maybe it's anti personnel equipment? Okay, actually, probably there's a way now, is it? Yes, okay, so Tesla Energy Weapons is infantry equipment. Okay. Pretty good. Alright, uh, that gives us some factories, but only 1 1, so not, that's not that great. Alright, um. Well, I guess we should research these infantry equipment techs even if we're uh, ahead of tech. Because, you know, they're going to be stronger. Alright, uh, they actually have some motorized. Shouldn't be too scary. Mm. Did we lose any close air supports? No, we didn't. Alright, that gives us um, air superiority, actually. Uh, we might want to use that. Let's try this. This might be a terrible decision. In fact, just to be sure, let's drop close to Carson City rather than on Carson City itself because what if there is a garrison there? Well, we don't want that to happen, now do we? Because even though there are power armor guys and all of that, they should they would probably just get killed. So yeah, no need for that, all right get more text. I'm sorry for the music not being the Fallout one, but the Fallout one is ultra copyrighted, so yeah. Unfortunate. Are there any new... No. No new theater shields or whatever you want to call them. Unfortunate. Alright, Time Loose Ends is done. Klamath. You know, we don't want puppets. We don't want puppets. We want slaves because we are the enclave. All right. I um, guess we take the Klamath deal. All right. Declare. Go. And go. All right. Okay, so I guess there was nothing there. And so we can just walk in. 
And we actually absolutely slaughtered them. Okay. Well, we're gonna lose some power armor from this, most likely. Which is sad. But, hey, at least we won. Alright. Come in here. Good. Carson City is ours. And destroyed them. Perfect. So how much did we lose? Two... Eh, we only lost two suits of power armor in that entire, you know, that entire ordeal. So that's okay. We can replace that. Okay, so that wasn't that bad. Uh, we are justifying just normally on New Battle Mountain. Uh, but New Battle Mountain only has one... <laughs> only has one... Um... Actually, hold on. Then I'm F. Only has one division, so yeah, no problem taking them down. All right. Uh, of course, up here it's gonna be a different little, different little uh, air zone. Okay, good. State coring action. Ooh. Uh, we can't do coring. The problem is uh, Fallon, Carson City, and Tobin Wasteland. We can get that uh, by setting up shop. So no point in wasting our political power and all of that. Let's just use the political power to do partial mobilization. One thing that I wanted to see is... What is this? Shift, execute. Now click on the map on the desired orders to toggle their execution. Oh my god. Oh wow. I didn't even know that this was a thing. Okay. That's very, very good. I like it. I like it a lot. I didn't know that that was the case. Well, the interface of this game is actually a little tiny bit better than what I thought because of this. That's pretty great. Of course, we can't really build any new uh, infantry forces right now because we lack manpower. All right, declare war. Don't even need to micro this. I mean, I'm just going to tell my guys to move and take the provinces. Just to be sure. Of course, they actually deployed some units. Battle Mountain. All right. Um... Then I guess we can micro. <laughs> Better. It's more fun this way. More fun this way. Alright. Uh, our men aren't really all that better than theirs. In fact, they're probably worse. But that's fine. Just stabilize, stabilize the situation and then go on the offensive. Like this. And now we take taking down the den so that we can destroy them. What is take the township? Gains cores. Okay. Uh, then why do I get a puppet focus for all if then I'm gonna take the cores? Whatever. Um, I guess you're supposed to annex it or something for like the puppet annexation. I don't know. Uh, is this yes yeah, so this is part of uh, this is part of the air zone so we should be getting air support and yeah this is rather pathetic to be honest oh well time to bring in the big boys time to bring in the big boys and they're actually getting volunteers from New Hammond and as you can see with the power armor troops coming in there yeah they're not going to have a fun time. Now let's crush them. Good. Fear factor one. And we don't need that. We need this, do we? No, we don't. Don't need heart attack yet. Let's get some engineering. Great. 
And yeah, as you can see, they get easily crushed. Uh, even though they've got friends coming in, these are mutants. No, 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 actually, these are ghouls. Or wait, these are mutants and these are ghouls. Is it? No, 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 these are all ghouls, okay. Unfortunately, the ghouls are relatively strong. And they are giving us some problems. But we win in the end. Call them and destroy them. Stop so that you don't take any unnecessary attrition. And then come in, come in. Okay. Crush him. Really now. You're supposed to support attack, please. Alright, our infantry is quickly demonstrating themselves to be a bunch of incompetent morons. But <laughs> if we if we don't take a look at that, then we're doing just fine. Uh, really, you should not be doing this. You should not be strategically redeploying like that. But I guess that's fine. We still have these guys surrounded. We can still kill them. Alright, stop them from escaping. Because if they do, that's very, very annoying. We just need to take the city here. Or, well, I mean the town, Golconda. It's only got 3,000 people, so it's not really a city. No, is it? Alright, we need to prevent these guys from taking any random territories. And we did. Good. This was harder than expected. <laughs> but it ended up working out. Now things are going to start to get a little bit more difficult. Which is pretty awesome. Wasteland Conscripts. Oh, right, these are... Okay, so this is the Western Brotherhood. They have special recruitment laws. Right, that makes sense for the Western Brotherhood, actually. All right. Uh, ship designer. No, we don't need that. Uh, we may, may need a military staff guy. All right. Let's take those things. Always pretty useful. All righty -o. Yeah, did we take that many losses here? Well, if we did... We're probably just replacing them right now, so that's pretty good. And yeah, we still have a stockpile and a half of strong power armor troops. Alright. Take down the den, take the township. Uh, I guess we can get the cores, but uh, let's get the cores on the other places first. Uh, right, this was also the one that I was manually justifying on. After this, who should we go for? Well, the Troll Warren seems to be expanding rather quickly, so we're going to have to destroy them. And of course, they are filthy muties, even though, I mean, we are the Enclave, so everyone is a filthy muty to us. Uh, I guess we can take down... Let's see who's the strongest in terms of economy. It is Chimalt Station. So justify, conquer. All right. And now we have the Wargle. Let's attack. They are land leasing people, and that's bad for them, because they're soon going to need the equipment to fight us. All right, take the Den, take Vermont. Of course, they don't have their units up here to face us. That's sad, because we're going to come in and kill them. Yeah, that's very unfortunate for you, is it? That is very unfortunate for you, my friend. It looks like you're gonna get crushed. Yes. I mean, maybe you just didn't have any units. No, you didn't. Well, that's pathetic. Alright. Metal armor. I mean, we've got power armor, so I'm not sure why this is improving our defense, but that's fine. Take laser muskets. All right, yo. And what was that on icon? I saw an icon. Oh, okay. Well, that's pretty good. All right, yo. So they're gone. Uh, of course, they have a troop in the capital, but just come in and kill them, please.
Good. I'm getting my factories sabotaged, I hear. But that's fine. All right, they are gone. No puppets focus for me. I'm going to kill them. All right, uh, I guess we can edit our infantry forces a little bit. Now that we have um, some army XP. Machine gun brigade, can we do that? No. Well, okay. The thing is, we don't need this many. It's actually lying, and I'll show you why. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Never mind. That's sad. And another machine gun brigade, okay. Alright, so right now they're literally 7 and 2. Uh, the reason I don't need that much is that with the units getting bigger, yeah, we need a lot more soldiers to fill up the manpower pool that we're supposed to have because duh, 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 I don't see exactly where, whatever. Uh, all of our guys are going to have some problems with strength, so what we're going to do is we're going to take like the worst units that have taken the most casualties and are the least experienced, then we're just going to disband them. Trashed in the can. Alright, and now, yes, now things are a little bit better. Now, are they? Alright. Okay, now we need to go to Shamalt Station to destroy these guys. Might want to take Arroyo to disrupt the expansion of the Brotherhood in these days, but... And as you can see, now we actually have free manpower. So I guess we can... Nah, you... None of you exist. Okay. We're, gonna just... We're just gonna keep one of these so that we have the uh, template without any support uh, equipments. Do we have support equipment now? No, we don't. Sigh. Maintenance company, we need support equipment. Explosives. Yes. Alright. So let's train up some PA divisions. Where's the capital? Arr. Right. Here we know. And we actually have 100%. Okay. So now we can start to train up some good stuff for a change. And now our attack is going to be slightly better. Uh, although, wait. Did I not change? Oh. Apparently I did not. Uh, well, that's sad. Alright. That's going to make you guys extra sad, I guess. Okay. Good. Do we still need electronics? We need electronics. Good. Uh, take the township, because these are better territories than the other ones, so I might as well have the cores on them. Get me some electronics, Caesar's Legion. And we're lacking in... I think manpower. Yes, we are lacking in manpower. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we need to disband a few of you. Alright. Now we should have enough manpower for everybody. Yes, we do. And yeah, other players are expanding, which is, of course, what happens. And it's one of the reasons I like this mod. People actually, like, expand and fight and do all sorts of things. So, it's pretty nice. Alright, um... You Verdi Birds should have a long range now, do you? Uh, range, 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 range. Yes, 1,500 kilometers. So it's no problem for you to get up here. Or here, North Nevada, or something like that. Okay. And I sincerely doubt that you have an Air Force. No, you don't. So, I guess that's fine. We can pair drop our guys in. 
I sure hope they don't have anyone in Schmalt Station. Because if they do, things can get rough. But yes, let's try to pair drop into the capital. And then make our offensive. Who the heck is this guy? Combat group. I don't see... <laughs> I don't see what these icons are supposed to mean. Okay, he's changed them over to infantry. Oh, these might be like machine gun com companies or something like that. Okay, so yeah. I have... Okay. So, that big square is the machine gun uh, brigade, and the other one is the company. Okay. So they also have machine guns. Ooh, scary. Alright, laser muskets. Good. And guerrilla tactics. Of course, we should have a new type of production now, should we? Yes, laser muskets. And take the township. Great. So that's going to give us some cores. And let's get some more cores. All right. How long is it going to take for us to justify? Not that long. Good. In the meantime, let's check out what other players are doing. Well, it seems like we have the uh, Mojave chapter of the Brotherhood fighting with New Vegas, and the Brotherhood is winning. This is a kind of a clash of quality titans. Both of those guys are very, very strong in terms of the quality of their troops. Uh, New Vegas with their, of course, Securitrons, and... The Brotherhood with their Paladins and all of that, but it seems like the Brotherhood is prevailing. But surely, wh whichever side wins is going to be very weakened, and then the NCR can swoop in and take care of the rest, which is what the NCR does best. The Emergency Council. Uh, looks like they have their problems up here. That's fine. And yeah, the Mojave Chapter 1. And Kaiser's Legion expanding in the east. Expanding in the east and taking care of like the twin mothers and all of that. So just making their own Carving their own path for the wastelands and all of this and that We however are getting stronger and uh, the legitimate government of the United States of America Will soon come in and take revenge upon all those who wronged us and all of that uh, I wonder what counts as artillery in this mod <laughs> All right, let's get uh, division attrition minus 8% might as well that seems like a pretty good thing. And the Troll Warren is getting stronger and stronger by the day. These guys are shipping up to be a tough fight. They have slaves, they have mutants, and uh, yeah, it could be interesting. All right. Uh, we should probably get after this, uh, I mean, spoils of war. Electricity and uh, whatever these are. These are metal. Okay. And then this is just outposts. We don't need outposts. Let's take six, 500 manpower. The savages of the Antelope tribe are worthless almost, except as potential slaves. Capturing the remnants of the tribe and putting them to work, even as personal bodyguards, is sure to have great benefit. Of course. Uh, even Reno itself is not exactly a city made up of nice people. Of course, we are the Enclave, so that's even worse. We have been taken over by the Enclave, so from bad to worse, literally. Uh, I should probably just rename all of these guys as slaves or something, because these are literally just my cannon fodder for my elite Enclave troops. All right. Declare war, call in allies, and destroy. Mm. How should we proceed? We'll probably do this, this, this this then you shall proceed upwards to try and connect up with my paratroopers who are going to be coming in all right yo and now you guys are going to come in and support like this all right. Of course, Shamalt Station was actually captured. Good. Um, okay, let's get Granite's company moving towards Rome March. Uh, uh, how much are we going to lose? 
Well, yeah, there's a very, very high percent of chance of losing our X01 suits, so I guess we just stop here and hold Chimalt Station. Because here we don't actually take any attrition. And we're just going to be content to sit here and enjoy the fruits of our successes. <laughs> and let our infantry catch up. All right. Of course, at this point, it looks like the other guys coming in is putting up some attrition anyway. So I guess we can start using our guys. Because it's not like it's going to change anything right now. All right. I'm just going to take them off of the plan. And we take Bly. Easy peasy. And we win. Alright. Now stop. And I think I'm going to end it for now. The Enclave has expanded. Perhaps not as much as we could have. But still, it's a pretty good expansion. And now we can start to produce the... Uh, let's get the heavy laser muskets first, and then the Tesla weapons. Uh, of course, we do have a fair stockpile of them, anyway. So that's pretty good. And alright, we actually have some PA divisions. Good. Uh, they're, of course, going to be untrained and not as useful, of course, as our veterans of many battles. But it's still better than nothing. And the next part, we're going to take on the Troll Warren. So I hope you'll join me, and I'll see you soon.